and welcome back. We're in the kitchen now with Chef Frank, who has a big dish for us. Yes. Baked stuffed shrimp. Yes. It smells fishy, but it, good. <laughs> <laughs> good to see you. Shrimp, good to see you as well. Good to see you as these well. These are some big shrimp. These are big. These are some big boys. These are colossal shrimp. Okay. So these are these are freshwater shrimp, actually. These are um, sustainable freshwater shrimp. They're mm -hmm. really good. Um, just so you know, these each are about a quarter of a pound. Yeah. Maybe a little less quarter of a they pound. So they're like big. It. Okay. Yeah, and we're serving this at Cappuccino's this week, and we served it this weekend, and it was a real hit. So basically, you know, these are probably going to be hard to find at the store, mm -hmm. but you can use any size shrimp to do this dish. You know, most of the shrimps will come peel and devein now, so basically you want to, you know, peel and devein your shrimp, but I've done it already, so we can take the liberty to show you, be a little quicker. Okay. So take your shrimp to do this uh, dish, you want to take it and you want to follow that devein line where the vein was, and you want to cut down, not all the way down so you get through, but just enough where you can flatten it out, okay? okay? So once you flatten that out, we're gonna make our little uh, crumb mixture, our filling. So we got some Ritz cracker crumbs, okay? We got some blue crab, mm. yum. And so now we're not only serving the shrimp, we're also serving yeah. the shrimp with, you know, other good great, seafood. Other great yeah. seafood. So that's more shrimp that I had to sacrifice one of those to make. <laughs> <laughs> we got some fresh parsley, uh -huh. okay? Got some fresh chopped garlic. We got some fresh um, onion. We got some white wine. We got some fresh lemon juice. Mm -hmm. Okay, and we got a little bit of cheese. Parmesan? Cheese. Yeah, That's Romano good. cheese. And to finish it off, we got some Hellman's mayonnaise. Ooh, okay. And that will help bind it all together. You know, there's egg and mayonnaise, of course, so that's going to help it keep it all together. So you want to incorporate all that really mm -hmm. well. Okay. Do you come up with these dishes? Yeah, I do. <laughs> well, this one looks really. You said those people really love this. Yeah, one. this was a, this was a hit this weekend, and I couldn't I couldn't make enough, so <laughs> so now we're so doing now it you're again. Make some more. Now we're gonna make some more for the weekend. So once you get that, we got we use these little scoopers here, like these little ice cream scoopers, uh -huh. okay? And then you just kind of take it, you can scoop one out, you put them in your shrimp, and then take the tail. And that kinds of hold it together, okay? Oh yeah, look so at that. So you do that, and then I got these little bacon dishes, which we we make a uh, scampi butter. Mm -hmm. So we take whole butter and we just mix some some seasonings in it: garlic, wine, fresh parsley, That's and then good. and then you just take your shrimp, you know, place them in there. You can get you should be able to get four, okay? okay? And then how we serve them at the restaurant is in that manner. And then we have this really nice saffron cream sauce that we finish it with. Perfect. Yeah. That looks delicious. Yeah. I have a feeling you're going to be awfully busy this week. <laughs> <laughs> we want to give everyone the best. And where can people find you? This is Cappuccino 7316 Kingston Pike. All right. Good to see you as always. Thank you very much. Yeah, Still well. to come here on 10 News at Noon.